scabies! Scabies for everyone! Because science says so. Hey everyone, Lazy Green here for DNews. In an area of scientific research fraught with political tension, time and time again the research indicates that LGBT parents are not the terrible and capable nurturers and guardians that some people believe they are. Same-sex parents are in fact pretty much the same as opposite-sex parents. I know guys, you're totally shocked by that. Prepare your mind to be blown because the research suggests that there might even be a few extra benefits to having gay dads or lesbian moms. For instance, having a baby never starts with oops. When you're lesbian or gay, there are no accidental babies. Having a kid is an intentional, often laborious process where you make the direct choice to have a baby, and you jump through all the hurdles to do so. Because of this, LGBT parents really, really want their babies, and they plan for it far in advance. And even better, the Evan B. Donaldson Adoption Institute found that most same-sex parents are adopting. They're adopting children from minority races and kids who are older than three, both of which are groups that have the hardest time getting out of the foster system. With nearly 500,000 kids waiting to be adopted at any given moment, lesbian and gay parents can provide great relief and stability for lots of children. People who are opposed to same-sex adoption often cite that it's detrimental to the child, but again we see, nope, not actually true. Take this study published in the American Journal of Orthopsychiatry that found that most people raised by gay or lesbian parents feel that it made them a more open and accepting person, and of rigid gender stereotypes? Kids of same-sex parents felt less restricted. Case studies indicate that they felt free to do what they liked, even when what they liked was considered a boy thing or a girl thing. Straight from the horse's mouth, y'all. Another study published in the Journal of Pediatrics found that children of lesbian parents score higher on psychological measures of confidence and self-esteem. The reason for this might come down to the stigma that families with two moms or two dads face out in the world. Because their families are cast out of the mainstream as alternative or abnormal, they're forced to have more open communication and to talk about topics and sexuality and gender with with their kids early on. So this open communication approach to parenting has been well documented as an effective way to raise children with confidence and maturity, and it also helps them better handle social differences and prejudices in their life. So this week, the American Academy of Pediatrics issued a policy change declaring its support for same-sex parents, including full foster care rights and full adoption rights, because it's backed by decades of research. The Academy said, quote, many studies have demonstrated that children's well-being is affected much more by their relationships with their parents, their parents' sense of competence and security, and the presence of social and economic support for the family than by the gender or sexual orientation of their parents. Relevant facts, because same-sex marriage and adoption policy battles are being duped out right this moment at the state and national level. So guys, let me know your thoughts on same-sex adoption down below, or send us a tweet at DNews, and I'll see you again soon.